So as far as food pairing goes, uh, personally, my theory is, is if your taste buds are happy, your body's probably going to follow. Uh, that works really nice with wine, uh, but everyone also loves to indulge with things like, oh, let's say, Girl Scout cookies. Um, it's not just things like um, fancy foods, but when you just want to sit down and relax and enjoy a good glass of wine after a really tough day, what's the best thing in the world? To combine your two favorites. Um, one of my personal favorites is the Samoa Girl Scout cookie, or I think they refer to them as Caramel Delights now. The one that's are the caramel covered toasted coconut with the soft cookie inside and the chocolate bottom. Oh, uh, that is actually quite delicious with our Pinot Noir, which unfortunately just sold out. <laughs> and also our Reserve Chardonnay. Uh, all the creamy and caramel notes to the wine itself emphasizes all those wonderful qualities on the cookie. Um, it's also nice and crisp as an opposite to that crisp cookie. Uh, and it's also very, very uh, earthy, so it goes well along well with the uh, toasted coconut. The Thin Mint, by far, is the hardest Girl Scout cookie pairing there is. Uh, and the Cabernet Franc grape, what the region is known for, is actually a very nice note for it. Um, it's known for a black pepper and spice, but when you pair it up with a Thin Mint, it starts bringing out some nice um, raspberry notes and some other uh, spice qualities like either cinnamon or nutmeg to the uh, wine itself. Uh, also, you've got the chocolate peanut butter cookies. What are those called? The tagalongs, I believe. Tagalongs are absolutely exceptional anytime you have a nice uh, red wine, but the one that everyone forgets, my favorite pairing with Chardonnay is a chocolate covered peanut butter bonbon. And both our main and reserve Chardonnays right now are incredibly delicious with that. And I will have to say, not a huge fan of one Girl Scout cookie. It was actually um, a lemon custard cookie with a lime cream in the middle and a lemon custard on the other side. For my taste, couldn't bear it. Uh, however, accidentally, I paired it with our dry Riesling and the lime and mineral quality with that cookie made that cookie unedible to unstoppable uh, as far as being able to stop yourself from finishing the box. <laughs> so, uh, again, it doesn't have to be fancy when you're doing food pairing, it just has to be enjoyable.